My first memory of cricket is actually not liking it. I actually didn't understand it, to be fair. My granddad was just throwing some balls at me. I just started hitting them. I loved it. My granddad used to watch cricket on the TV, so I'm always like watching cricket. I'm always playing cricket with my friends. Playing for England would mean absolutely everything to me. It means pretty much everything. It's kind of like a passion. <laughs> so five to ten years, right? I think there'll be international T10 cricket. More interesting cricket. Test will be like played in like four day. A little bit more public and a little bit more diverse. And I think it'll be more inclusive. I think it's important to see diversity in the game for so many reasons. For me, it's about representing the society we live in. Because I want a kid to turn on a TV or see an advert and they see something in themselves. It makes such a difference for a young person to be inspired and know they can achieve and things are possible and accessible to them. So yeah, we're just trying to use ACE as a platform and a lot of the work we're doing is sharing positive images and I think people just seeing young people from different backgrounds playing and seeing that on cameras or TV will really um, inspire others that it's a game for them. The programme represents empowering young people, um, particularly from the black British community, to express themselves, be confident and um, play cricket as they want, but also just develop them as people as well as players. The, the talent has been amazing. Going into the programme, we didn't actually know what to expect. Nearly half didn't have any sort of cricket club at all, but yet still some were good enough to be part of an academy programme. We saw so much talent, uh, three or four that we thought with some good investment could be playing county cricket. One example in particular, Idris, who was amazing with playing you know, club cricket, should definitely have been in a county structure, got into ace, and then within a short period of time played a couple of Surrey under 18s games. 78. 78. Yeah. Before this programme I've never heard of anything like it, especially in England and what Ebony has done has been great and everyone else has been a part of it to get it started. Cricket is known to be a very privileged sport, which like myself coming from like humble backgrounds, it's, it's much more difficult for us to just show like what we've got. But with programmes like this, it should progress and hopefully other counties can make this a massive thing. How I want to see cricket in this country in five to ten years' time, I want it to reflect society. Cricket and sport plays a massive part in help changing that landscape. We're excited to have just partnered with Royal London, where we're going to be going into Bristol to look for more talent. Going to other cities is massive, and we're so pleased that Royal London have come on board for Bristol as a key partner to support that development and growth. People working together, a good strategy, and, and the whole landscape could be really powerful and it will feel like a sport for everybody.